What's up guys, we're back with another full length video. I might start to make full length videos like every week or something. But today we're gonna be talking about can you bleed the dark saber? Before we get into the video, I will explain how you bleed a lightsaber, but before we get into the video, before we get into the video, spoilers, spoiler warning if you have not watched the Mandalorian, Acolyte, Book of Boba Fett, or any Star Wars movies yet or shows, there's Spoiler warning. Alright. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so yesterday I was rewatching The Mandalorian a little bit and just kinda you know, watching it again because I want I felt like I felt like I needed to watch those last couple of episodes because I remember that the Dark Saber is a lightsaber, right? Just like any other lightsaber. Okay. Noises. Fair warning, this thing is like old as crap. Like, I got this in like 20, maybe 2019 when the show came out. So, you see, it's not the shit, it's not the shape of a normal lightsaber, it's the shape, shape of like a sword. So, it's kind of the shape of like a sword, but it is definitely a lightsaber. And we know that every lightsaber has a crystal, and that's what makes it light up, like in the Ahsoka book. She takes out the Inquisitor's lightsaber crystals, and she purifies them and makes her own lightsabers, but that's for another video. So, but today we're going to talk about the light, this, this lightsaber. So, in the Acolyte, the final episode, uh, well not final, we might get another season, Osha, she kills Saul with the Force, chokes him to death. But as she's doing it, it zooms in onto the inside of the lightsaber that she's holding, which is Soul's lightsaber. And it's turning red. It, it's bleeding. And that is how all Siths and whatever turn their lightsabers red. Is they originally start out as a blue or green or any something like that. And then they have to do this like bad deed, like kill somebody, and then it turns red, and that's how they get the red lightsaber. That's why uh, Darth Vader, uh, he had a blue lightsaber, but then after, uh, after he kind of killed or chucked Padme, she, he didn't kill her, um, but after he choked Padme, it did, um, it did turn red eventually. Um, but yeah, so in the Acolyte, she bled Soul's lightsaber. Right. So I was wondering when I was rewatching this, could you possibly believe this? Now, obviously, this lightsaber, you can see it's white on the edges, and it's, and it's black right here. So it's white here, and it kind of glows. But if you could bleed the crystal, if a Jedi got a hold of this, Mandalorians don't follow the same rules as Jedi. So. This is a Mandalorian lightsaber, but if a Jedi had this lightsaber, this exact lightsaber, yeah, the dark saber, and they used the force or something to kill somebody while they had their lightsaber like this, would it turn red? And if it's so, what part? Would the whole thing be red? Or just the white ring? Or just these little crackles of electricity that are white right now? Would that turn red and then this black part would stay the same? Because that would look awesome. This is broken. Uh, one time on Christmas Eve, uh, one of the neighborhood kids came over and me and my siblings had a giant lightsaber duel. I was using this and the thing that kept it on my belt broke. But it's fine. It doesn't really matter. It's just the lightsaber and it was... So, here it's broken obviously, but like the crystal would sit somewhere right here, right? But when Gideon crushed it, he like when Gideon crushed it, um, there was electricity and wires coming out. So that makes me think: Is there actually a crystal, and how is the crystal black? How did they get a black crystal? We know the handle is probably Beskar, and um, the new stormtroopers were Beskar. 
right in the Mandalorian, yes, they were. But did we see any Beskar stormtroopers in the sequel trilogy? In the sequel trilogy, they have the same old... There's a bee in my room, I think. Okay, but whatever. Anyways, um... I feel like... I don't... Is there an answer? Because, technically, if a lightsaber has a crystal, you could bleed it. The Mandalorians, it's impossible to bleed it because they don't really have rules. They don't really have that much rules. They kill whoever whoever messes with them or whoever does whatever. Okay, sorry guys. <laughs> My nose keeps getting crushed by this thing. Um, and okay, I'm so sorry. Um, so. With this theory, if Obi-Wan had his lightsaber, pretend this is Obi-Wan's lightsaber, and he chops off another guy's head, and this person's on he just walks up behind somebody and just, um, and he just, uh, cuts your head off, um, his lightsaber would bleed, right? I'm pretty sure it would. It would definitely bleed. So, if it would bleed, if it bleed, uh, uh, <clears throat> it would bleed, right? So, with that logic, the dark saber, if it had a crystal, and a Jedi had it, and they broke the rules while well, they had it, they were the wielder of this weapon, and they had it, and they choked you to death. Or, here, I'm gonna be describing you. Pretend like I'm a Jedi. Oh, dark saber, it's white. <laughs> Snaps your neck. Oh crap, it's red. I'm not obviously I'm not gonna color on this and make it red. Uh I do that with my Legos already. <laughs> but I'm not gonna do anything to this, but I was just wondering if if you can draw uh anybody in the comments or you don't even have to comment on this video. You just have to you can draw a, a dark saber, but make to like the tips red and this little electricity crackles inside there red. But keep this part like black if you can draw that. Plus the handle, if you can draw that, my Instagram is in my bio, and you can just DM me um, a photo of it, and that would be awesome. And I will make a, vi a whole video about your drawing uh, if you can do that. So that's probably the end of the video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. That um, I'm still gonna continue making shorts and stuff, but like the, the long form videos will probably just be like I don't know, but um, like every week or something, or maybe very rarely. So that's the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm gonna go edit this. Bye. Like and subscribe.